Welcome to another edition of Anthony T's Horror Views. Today I'm going to talk about The Barn. The film is has been one of indie horror's best kept secrets. As it was self-distributed about, about a, year, a year and a half ago. And, it, and it's finally being exposed to the world. Instead of us horror fans. This film is definitely a film you should check out. The film has great direction from Justin Seaman, who I believe is what the Bond was his first film. He does a very good job keeping the action moving, whether it's in the direction or whether it's in the uh, screenplay. Everything moves at a very good pace. There's never a dull moment in this film, which is always a good thing. Because sometimes you'll see horror films, oh, they'll have a great, so they'll have a dull moment or two. We just mm, we tend to lose interest. This film, I did not lose interest in one bit. It also helped that this film has a good amount of gore. Which made it more fun. I thought the cast in this film was very good. I like how they had good chemistry with each other. It made some of the dialogue scenes worth watching. It also made the characters interesting. Which, let's face it, you want in a film like this. The film also has uh, special appearances by Linnea Quigley and Ari Letterman, who was the first Jason Voorhees in the first Friday the 13th film. For those people who do not know, that Jason briefly appeared in the first Friday the 13th film at the very end of the film. Full spoiler, but... Let's get back to the review, as we're here to talk about The Bond, not Friday the 13th. The Bond is a great film. When you have cameos in your film and they feel like afterthoughts, then it is a great film. I can truly say you will enjoy The Bond. And also another thing... Before I end this review, the film has also has a great score from Rocky Gray. It's very rare for an indie horror film to also have a great score to go along with its screenplay and its cast and acting. But this film, the score was great. Literally. It felt like another character in the film, which of course makes the film more better. Look at some of the Italian horror films like The Beyond, Antenebrae, and Suspiria. Those films had great scores that helped enhanced, enhance their film. The score for the Bond here enhances the film. It makes it more creepy and more fun to watch. I highly recommend you check this film out. Whether you go to Scream Team Releasing's official site and purchase the film on DVD or Blu-ray. Or to various VOD providers in which the bond is being carried on. I will leave a description in the show notes on how you can get this film because I really want you to see this film. This film definitely will get the Horror Chamber's seal of approval as the Bond is definitely going to be on my Halloween watch list this year. I want to thank you again for watching this video. Feel free to leave comments positive or negative tell me how I'm doing 
and thank you for watching this video. Support indie horror and have a good day.